Lincoln, Nebraska, located in the vast region of the Great Plains, is filled with an ambience of high-intensity college football. And while Lee Corso might be excited about this rain and that free car wash he's getting, these fans are excited for this matchup between the TCU Horn Frogs and the Nebraska Cornhuskers. Hi, everybody. I'm Brad Nessler with Lee Corso and Kirk Herbstreet to bring you all the high-intensity action of week one to help you answer the question, who will be crowned national champions this year? The Cornhuskers don't appear to have much competition in this game, do they, Lee? Forget about it. Nebraska is going to come in here and pound the ball right at this defense. And when they're done with that, Kirk, they're going to pound them and pound them and pound them even more. You're right, Lee. This one won't be much of a contest. Nebraska has an outstanding quarterback who can really put up some big numbers against this defense. Brad, look for him to have a big game. Nebraska has won the toss and elects to play offense first. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. He kicks it. Number 13 takes it at the 8. And he couldn't get a thing going with that return, Lee Corso. Brad, let me tell you something about kickoff returns. They require good blocking and precise timing. They didn't have either one of those things right there. Ball on their own 17. First and 10. TCU comes out in a 4-3. Back to throw. He passes it. Complete. Number 39 with a takedown at the 39. What a play. Boy, solid job there by the quarterback, recognizing the defensive coverage and delivering the ball to the open receiver. Ball on their own 39. First and 10. TCU lines up defensively in a 4-3. Number 43 brings him down for a loss. Loss of about two. Ball on the 37. TCU comes out in a 3-4. Back to pass. He guns it to the left. Couldn't haul it in. on the 37-yard line. TCU lines up in a dime defense here. Back to pass. Rifles it over the middle. He's got the first. Number 17 brings him down at the 38. And they convert the third down with a long pass play. You're right, Brad, and that was a long pass play. As a coach, you got to appreciate it when your players come out and perform like these kids are doing right now. And here's another look at that pass, Kirk. Boy, Brad, what a great throw by the quarterback. I mean, this guy doesn't mess around. He sees his target wide open, gets him the ball quickly. Look at the velocity on that throw. It's first and ten. Defense lines up in a 4-3. And he's going to lose yards on this one. That'll be a loss of one. Ball on the 40. Number 30 lines up in the deep back. Eye formation. Number 25 with a takedown at the 33-yard line. Only managed a few yards on that play before they could wrestle him down. Yeah, really a nice-looking play there by the offense. Very good blocking up front. Right. 
Seventh play of this drive coming up. Number seven lines up in the shotgun. At the 33-yard line. He drops back. Throws it out there. First down. Number 30 brings him down at the 18. Wow, how about that third down conversion? Boy, what a play here, guys. I'm really impressed with the poise of this young quarterback. He was very cool and collected out there on that third and long play. We'll see what they can do in the red zone. High formation here. Number 48 with a takedown at the 18-yard line. Back to the line of scrimmage, and that's it. Second and nine coming up here. Ball on the 18-yard line. They come out in a goal line set. Back to pass. He passes it, and it's caught. Brought down at the 10-yard line. Seven yards there. Four three defense. They'll run the option. He laterals the ball. An eight yard gain. They're crowding the line. First and goal at the two yard line. Number 30 gets a pitch, and he gets the touchdown. He was not going to be denied on that one, guys. You're right, Brad. He saw the goal line and just plowed ahead until he crossed it. Nebraska to kick this one off. Here's the kick. Number 39 fields it at the two. Gets past the tackler. Number 37 with a recovery. Ball on the 16-yard line. First and 10. TCU lines up defensively in a 4-3. Gets that one. Number 17 brings him down at the 9-yard line. And a big change in momentum right there, Kirk. Well, the defense is playing inspired football right now. The ball popped out, and everybody was on the ground grabbing for it. Ball on the five. First and ten. TCU will line up in a jumbo set here. First and ten at the five yard line. Gets a call. He's hit and got away. And they fall on the loose ball. Well, they avoided the turnover right there. Yikes. That was a close one. Good thing that kid was paying attention and fell on the football. on the two-yard line. 
High formation here. Number 14 with a takedown at the nine. He picked up big yardage on that run. Oh, this is great blocking up front. Nice job of holding on to their blocks, allowing him to break through for some big yards. Ball on the nine. Third and five coming up. Four three defense. They'll run the option. And they got him for a loss. Drop back a yard. It's fourth down and six. Ball on the eight yard line. Number five, the return man. Punts the ball away. Number five, fields it at the 50. And they make the stop at the 44. Just couldn't break free on that one. Now, Brad, he didn't have a lot of open field to run, but he did a nice job of making something out of nothing. Ball on the 44-yard line. Nebraska lines up in the power eye set. First and 10 at the 44-yard line. They'll run the option. Number 43 brings him down at the 39-yard line. Well, Coach, he picked up a few yards on that one. Brad, tough running by this kid. It's second down and five to go. Ball on the 39. The Cornhuskers line up in the Maryland Eye formation. He spins. Number 39 with a takedown at the 35. That's a three-yard pickup. And we've come to the end of the first quarter with the score. Nebraska, seven. TCU, nothing. We are ready to start quarter number two. Third and one. Ball on the 35-yard line. They put everyone up on the line. On the option. Nothing doing. Tackled for a loss on the play. And they're going the wrong way, Coach. Hey, Brad, if you don't have offensive balance, you can't keep the defense off of you. Ball on the 39-yard line. Fourth down and five. Number 39, back deep to return. He gets it away. Coach, how do you pin the ball deep like that? That's due to hours and hours of practice. I'll bet that kid has practiced that punt a thousand times. Ball on the two-yard line. It's first and ten. Number 22 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Spin move. Breaks a tackle. Tackle at the 17. They get a nice run, and that will be enough for the first down. Yo, this kid has some sensational moves. Ball on their own 17. It's first and 10. The Horn Frogs line up in an eye formation. And he's tackled at the 28. That's a 10-yard gain. Ball on the 28-yard line. First and 10. They use four linebackers. Steps back to pass. Let's it go. Tackle at the 35. Seven yard play. Ball on the 35 yard line. They line up in an eye. They'll run the option. 
He laterals the ball. He didn't really have a chance on that play. Boy, guys, how about the defense on this play? They sniffed that play out from the start. Third and two. Nebraska going with a three-man front. They're bringing it. Number 43 brings him down to the 38-yard line. Two-yard pickup. This is the sixth play of this drive. Number 22 lines up in the deep back, eye formation. Number five tips it away. And they do a good job at swatting that one away. You're right, Brad. Excellent awareness by the defender to know where the football is and is get his hand on it. Ball on their own 38, second and 10. Number 22 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Number 48 with a takedown at the 41. A pickup of about three. Ball on the 41. It's third down and six to go. The Horn Frost go with the eye formation. He's looking for his man. Number 43 brings him down at the 44. He jumped up and snagged that ball. Well, the quarterback threw the ball too high. Credit his receiver for going up to make the play. Ball on the 44-yard line. It's first and 10. Nebraska lines up defensively in a 3-4. They're bringing it. Number 90 with a takedown at the 40-yard line. Personal foul, illegal block, offense. That's a 15-yard penalty. Ball on the 45-yard line. It's first and a mile. The Cornhuskers line up at a nickelback. Number 34 brings him down at the 48-yard line. Nowhere to go on that play, Coach. Boy, you're absolutely right, Brad. This is a great job by the defense in not giving him any room to create anything. This is the 10th play of this drive. Step back to pass. Throws it out there. Number 91 with a catch. They'll bring him down at the 36-yard line. They line up in an eye, drops back, he passes it. Number 81 makes the catch, he tries to spin, and they push him out at the 23. Oh my, that long game gives him a first down, Coach. A first down and a nice pass play. Knowing you can convert on third and long will open up your offense a little bit more on first and second. Let's see what they do from here. First and ten. The Horned Frog come out in the ace formation. He's got the first, and he's tackled at the one. And he picked up a nice game there before being tackled. Man, does this kid have some speed? Hello. They're crowding that line of scrimmage. Let's it go. 
And that's a tough play to make, Coach. You know, having to concentrate on the ball while the ball is still in the air sometimes causes the receiver not to be aware of where the sideline is. They're crowding the line, running the option. A little juke. Touchdown, Horn Frog. Well, he didn't have far to go on that one. Well, Brad, when you get inside the five-yard line, you have to rely on the offensive line and great execution. That's exactly what they did right there. the PAT. TCU ready to kick this one off. He kicks it. Number three. Fields it at the three. That was a nice kick return. Hey, fantastic effort right there. He got some good blocking and a nice job to find the open field. First and ten. Ball on the 40-yard line. Nebraska comes out in the shotgun. Drops back. Fires a bullet out to the right. First down. And he's finally shoved out at the 32. And he delivered a nice pass there, Coach. Now, this is what I'm talking about. I like what this coach is doing here by opening up his playbook. It's going to have the defense calling for mercy soon. First and ten. TCU comes out in a 4-3. Number seven on play action. Rolling out to the right side. Number 30 has it. Number 39 with a takedown. That's the 31. Second and eight coming up here. Ball in the 31. Second and eight at the 31. The offense takes a timeout. We're at the one-minute mark, first half. Back to pass. Throws it out there. Number 89 hangs on to it. Going with the shotgun here. Drops back to pass. He fires left side. Number 39. Bats it down. And that was a good defensive play. Yeah, guys, this is because he's in great position to make the play. The Horned Frog come out of the 34 defense. He's rolling right. He lets it go. Number nine drops the ball. The Corn Huskers line up in an eye formation. Drops back to pass. Let's it go. Incomplete. He just let that one slip out of his hand. Oh, he can't take his eyes off the ball. It looks like that's what happened. Right. 
Number 26, lined up for the field goal. This should be a chip shot. He gets it up, and it splits the uprights. Nebraska is ready to kick it away. Number three and number zero back deep to return. Number 26 kicks it off. Number 39 fields it in the end zone. Twenty-two. First and ten. TCU goes with the ace set here. Drops back to pass. Throws it out there, and it falls incomplete. Second and ten. The Cornhuskers line up in a 3 4. Second and ten at the 22 yard line. Steps back to pass. He passes it. It falls incomplete. It's third down and ten. TCU comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Back to throw. Let's it go. And it's caught. And they finally tackle him at the 34. Ball in the 34. It's first and 10. The Cornhuskers come out in a 34 defense. Number 34 brings him down at the 31 yard line. Called by the offense. Second and seven. Ball in the 31. The Horned Frogs go with the I formation. Back to throw. He's looking for his man, and it's knocked away. He tipped that one away, guys. Well, he could have probably made the interception there, but he'll gladly take an incompletion. Ball on the 31-yard line. High formation here. Number one drops the throw. Throws it out there. Number 22 with a catch. The offense takes a timeout. Ball on the 31. Fourth down now, seven yards to go. It looks like they're going to try for the long field goal. He gets it up. And it sails right on him. No good. First and ten, ball on the 31. Number 30 lines up in the deep back, high formation. Duke move. Number 49 with a takedown at the 42 yard line. Ball 
on the 42-yard line. First and 10. TCU lines up defensively in a 4-3. He juke. Brought down at the 50. And we've reached halftime here. The score at the break. Nebraska 10, TCU 7. And the teams are lined up to start the second half. Number 26 kicks it off. Number three fields it in the end zone. First and ten, ball on the 21. The Cornhuskers put four men up front. Number 57 brings him down for a loss. No gain. It's second down and 10 to go. Nebraska comes out defensively with six defensive backs. Number 57 brings him down at the 22-yard line. They got him tied up and he couldn't get anywhere. Brad, I love how that defense attacked this run. Third and eight. Nebraska lines up with five defensive backs. Drops back to pass. Let's it go. It's dropped. That one should have been caught. Oh, man, that really irritates a quarterback. He did his job to get the ball there, and the receiver blew it by dropping it. Ball on the 22. Fourth down, eight yards to go. Number five, awaiting the return. Number 26 gets it off. Number five fields it at the 41. Ball on their own 41. First and 10. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Number 43 with a takedown at the 41-yard line. He didn't get much on that play at all. Brad, the defense had that play read and sealed it off from the get-go. Ball on their own 41. Second and nine coming up here. The Cornhuskers line up in an eye formation. He's got the first, great one. Number 43 brings him down at the 41. That was a nice run. Well, he did a nice job of keeping his feet moving. Good, solid run. Here it is again. First and ten. Ball on the 41-yard line. The Horned Frogs come out in a 34 defense. Drops the throw. He's looking for his man. First down. They'll bring him down at the 27-yard line. First down. What a pass. Boy, that was a big-time throw by the quarterback. He did a good job of taking what the defense gives him. First and ten, ball on the 27. High formation here. First and ten at the 27-yard line. They're bringing it. 
He spins around. He dukes. And down he goes at the 21-yard line. Though he picked up a few yards before they brought him down. You know, it wasn't a huge gain, but if they can continue to do that, they'll force the defense to respect that run, and that'll open up the passing game. It's second down and four to go. Ball on the 21. The Cornhuskers come out of the power eye. Tries to juke. Number 17 with a takedown at the 17. Only managed a few yards on that play before they could wrestle him down. Yeah, really a nice looking play there by the offense. Very good blocking up front. Third down, less than a yard. The Cornhuskers line up in an eye formation. Here they come. He's got the first. Number 30 brings him down at the one. Nice pick up there for the first down. Boy, there was a great block there. The reason why that's a great block is because he got in the guy's face and he do what they call chicken fighting. You get in the guy's face and you kind of dance with him away from the ball carrier. They put everyone up on the line. He spins and he's in the end zone. Touchdown. He was not going to be denied on that one, guys. You're right, Brad. He saw the goal line and just plowed ahead until he crossed it. Nebraska to kick, number 39, and number three, back to return. Number 26, kicks it off. Number 39, fields it at the nine. It's first and 10, ball on the 19. They use four linebackers. Gets the ball. No, they faked it. He lets it go. He spins around. They'll bring him down at the 35-yard line. And they get the first down on that completion, Coach. That was a very nice first down conversion. The key to that play was the fact that the quarterback had plenty of time to look downfield. It's first and 10, ball on their own 35. The Horned Frog go with the eye formation. Number 90 with a takedown at the 40-yard line. A five-yard gain. Ball on the 40-yard line. Second and four coming up here. Three-man front defensively. He drops back. He unloads it. Complete. And he's tackled at the 47-yard line. So they pick up quite a few yards on that play, Kirk. Well, that was an excellent route, and he did a great job of holding on to the football. Ball on the 47. It's first and 10. Four three defense. And down he goes at the 45 yard line. The defense just swarmed over him on that one. Yeah, they were able to penetrate the offensive line and get to the running back before that play even had a chance.
Ball on the 45 yard line. Second and seven. TCU sets up in the eye. He drops back. Rifles it right side. It falls incomplete. Pass interference. Defense. Ball on the 30-yard line. TCU comes out with an eye formation. Number 71 brings him down at the 28-yard line. Gain of two. And that's the end of the third quarter. Our score in this one, Nebraska 17, TCU 7. And we're ready for the start of the fourth quarter. Ball on the 28-yard line. Second and seven coming up here. Nebraska comes out at a 4-3. Back to pass. He lets it go. First down. He made the grab near the sideline. Those passes take a great deal of concentration because you have to catch the ball and make sure you're in bounds. They're crossing the line. A little juke. Touchdown. They worked it on the ground, coach, and the result, six points. Brad, absolutely right. Hey, they made it look easy. on the extra point. TCU ready to kick this one off. Number 13 and number zero set to return. Here's the kick. Number 13 fields it in the end zone. It's first and ten. Huskers line up in an eye formation. Number 92 with a takedown at the 18. He didn't get much on that play at all. Brad, the defense had that play read and sealed it off from the get-go. It's second down and nine to go. Ball on the 18-yard line. Nebraska sets up in the eye. He drops back. Let's it fly. Number 81 makes the catch. We knew these receivers were fast and athletic, and they are not disappointing us. I think these guys are the difference makers in the game. I would expect to see the deep routes to keep coming and coming at this defense. First and 10, ball on their own 43. TCU comes out in a 3-4. He's got the first. Number two brings him down at the 46-yard line. They picked up good yardage on that one, Lee Corso. Oh, baby. Did the O-line create a lane for him to run through or what? Ball on the 46. It's first and 10. TCU going with a three-man front. 
Drops back. Let's it go. And it's caught. And he's taken down at the 40-yard line. Nice little pattern there. Yeah, he had great position there. And that ball was thrown in the right spot. Ball on the 40-yard line. The Cornhuskers come out in the ace formation. On the option, he laterals the ball. They'll wrestle him down in the backfield. Loss of about two. It's third down and six to go. The Horned Frogs bring in their dime package. Back to pass. He's looking for his man. Number 30 knocks it away. Well, he tried to thread the needle with that pass. Well, here the quarterback makes a poor decision throwing into coverage. He needs to look at his progression and find the second and third receiver. It's fourth down and six yards to go. Ball on the 42-yard line. Number 39, back to return it. Number 46, gets it off. Ball on their own 21. Defense lines up in a 3-4. Defense is blitzing. Number 14 with a takedown at the 29-yard line. They grab eight yards there. Ball on the 29. Going with the shotgun here. Here comes the defense, and he's going to lose yards on this one. They've stopped for a six-yard loss on the play. Ball on the 22. It's third down and eight to go. The court up here bring in the nickel package. Number 22 has it. They couldn't get the first down. Well, here they were hoping to get a few extra yards after the catch. Give the defense credit. They held him short. Fourth and five coming up here. Ball in the 25. Number five, the return man. Number 26 gets it off. First and ten. The Cornhuskers put four men up front. He's tackled at the 28-yard line. Well, he managed a few yards on that play before they could wrestle him down. Yeah, really a nice-looking play there by the offense. Very good blocking up front. Ball on the 28. It's second down and five to go. TCU comes out with an eye formation. Back to throw. He throws it. Number three hangs on to it. And he threw that ball in there nicely. Did you see that, Coach? Yes, I did, Brad. And that was a good pass and a very good game. The Cornhuskers come out into 34 defense. Complete touchdown. Horn ball. And that one worked just like they draw it up, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, you're exactly right. Offensive line did a good job of protecting the quarterback. Good route by the receivers. Results, touchdown.
and he hits the PAT. TCU lines up for the kickoff. He kicks it. Number 13 fields it at the one. It's first and ten. Number 30 is the deep back as they line up in the eye. Drops back. Let's it go. And it's caught. He's knocked out of bounds at the 47. Hey, what a great catch. Yeah, he was aware of where the sideline was and made sure he stayed in bounds when he caught the ball. TCU lines up defensively in a 4-3. Drops back. He passes it. Complete. Eight yards on the pickup. Second and one, ball on the 45. The Horned Frog put four men up front. Back to pass. He's looking for his man. Incomplete pass. And an outstanding play defensively. Yeah, he timed it perfectly and managed to get a hand in there to deflect the ball away. Third and one, ball on the 45-yard line. Nebraska comes out in the shotgun. Third and one at the 45-yard line. Drops to throw. He fires right. Well, he made the catch, but he didn't stay in bounds. Well, this one's on the quarterback. The quarterback needs to give him a little bit more room to work with on the sideline. Ball on the 45. They put everyone up on the line. At the 45-yard line. First down, and he's tackled at the 42. That's a three-yard pickup. Ball on the 42. Timeout called by the offense. Sixth play of this drive coming up. TCU comes out in a 4-3. He drops back. He lets it go. And it's incomplete. Kirky just let that one get away from him. Yeah, and you can see he wants that one back. That's a throw this guy can make in his sleep. on the 42-yard line. So it's second and 10. Nebraska sets up in the eye. Back to pass. He passes it. And that one's fallen incomplete. Well, he missed his receiver there, coach. Yo, this kid needs to relax a little bit more. That ball's coming out 100 miles an hour. You can't expect the receivers to get to that one. Third down and 10 coming up. Nebraska comes out with an eye formation. With a nice play fake, guns it across the middle. Incomplete. 
And he just let that one slip out of his hand. Oh, he can't take his eyes off the ball. It looks like that's what happened. Fourth and ten coming up. Ball on the 42. High formation here. Back to pass. He unloads it. And they couldn't hook up on that one. And the D answered the call there. And this is huge for them. It's setting up the stage for their offense to take the field and make some big-time plays. First and ten. Ball on the 42-yard line. Ball on the 49-yard line. Defense lines up in a 4-3. Little shake and bake move. Number 98 brings him down at midfield. The defense takes a timeout on the play. Ball right around midfield. TCU sets up in the eye. He's got the first. He stiff arm. Number 14 with a takedown at the 17. Great run there for the first. Yeah, good blocking on this play, Brad. But an excellent job by the ball carrier to square his shoulders and pound his way for the first. Ball on the 17-yard line. First and 10. Nebraska lines up defensively in a 3-4. That makes the score TCU 21, Nebraska 17. And that's the end of the ball game. Any final thoughts on this one, Coach? Wow, what a fantastic football game this was. Down to the wire. TCU did a sensational job hanging in there all day when nobody gave him much of a chance. I watched him, and I kept thinking they were going to crack, but they didn't. They held tough, and they pulled off a huge, I mean huge, upset. Well, that'll wrap up another chapter in NCAA Football 2002. And our final score, TCU 21. Nebraska, 17. Our thanks go out to everyone here at EA Sports. I'm Brad Nessler for Kirk Herbstreit and Lee Corso, signing off. Until next time, so long, everybody.